Oh hi, I'm Mr. Jones, and I study mathematics. Oh, hello there. My name is Mr. Stipes, and I study mathematics. I wasn't always good at mathematics. How did you learn? Well, I used the power of the note cards. Let me show you how I study. I'll take a note card right here. I will write the problem on the front of the note card, flip that bad boy over, write my steps and the answers on the back. I will look at the problem, go through my steps and the answers, answer the question, look back to check my work to see if I'm right, and boom, I've studied. Go through it yourself. We're going to take our note cards and write the problem on the front. Then we're going to turn it over and write the steps and how to solve it on the back with the answer. Then we're going to go through, check the problem in our heads, and then we're going to check our work on the back, and then boom, you've studied. So Mr. Jones, let's yeah. go ahead and use this and learn some calculus while we do it. Well, all right, Mr. Stipes. All right. Our first step is to write the problem on the front. So here we have our problem. Y equals 2x cubed minus 5, and we are going to find y prime, or the derivative of y. We start by writing the problem on the front, and then we flip it over to the back for step two. And there we write out our problem and all the steps to solve the problem. Step three, we would take the problem from the front, and we would answer it and study in our head, and then we would check our work on the back. So can I try it, Mr. Stipes? Please, Mr. Jones. Well, all right. Our problem is y equals 2x cubed minus 5. Find y prime. Let me review before I test myself. I'm going to write the problem out, and then I'm going to write the steps for solving y prime. It's going to be bring your 3 over to the coefficient of your first term, because 3 was the exponent, and that's now 3 times 2. Then I'm going to subtract 1 from my original exponent, giving me a new exponent of 2. If you take the derivative of any constant, you're going to get 0. And so now I am left with 6x squared. Hmm, am I ready to test myself? Let me look at the front of the card again. y equals 2x cubed minus 5, find y prime. Well first, I am going to rewrite my problem. Then I'm going to bring my 3 over to the coefficient of that 2 and multiply those two together. But because I had to use this exponent, I'm going to subtract 1 from it. 3 minus 1 is 2, so my new exponent is 2. The derivative of any constant is 0. So I should end up with y equals 6x squared, point blank. Let me check. Booyah!